Hi, I'm Sabine from Porsche and today I will be explaining fast charging in general and in particular how to access the Porsche charging superpowers. Charging superpowers? Yes, charging an electric Porsche can be really fast. So let's start with the physical basics that everyone has to deal with. AC and DC. Electricity comes in these two forms and gives us two different types of chargers. The good news is you can charge your all-electric Porsche with both. When electrical energy is stored in batteries, it is done with direct current. But AC, alternating current, is all around us and is the standard power that comes from the grid into our homes and out of our sockets. For this reason, electricity from the grid has to be converted to DC at some point to charge the vehicle's high-voltage battery pack. The necessary conversion to DC takes place inside the vehicle in what is known as the onboard charger. AC charging is most commonly used when plugging in at home or at the office. The output of the power lines in residential areas is limited. This is perfectly acceptable if longer charging times are not an issue. The car is usually parked here for several hours, which is ideal for charging your electric vehicle. In comparison, the power level of DC charging points starts at around about 50 kilowatts and currently reaches up to 350 kilowatts. Because of this potential higher power, DC charging is often referred to as DC fast charging. DC fast charging is typically used when traveling long distances or when there is no charging option at home. With DC charging, the energy goes directly into the battery, bypassing the vehicle's onboard charger. As the conversion can take place outside the car, more space can be used for very large rectifiers, which provides significantly more power for the charging process. Another important aspect in terms of charging speed is the charging capability of your vehicle for both AC and DC charging. The battery must also contribute to the fast flow of energy. To fast charge a battery, its state of charge must be low and the battery temperature must be within the range for fast charging. When a vehicle's specific state of charge is reached during DC charging, the charging power gradually decreases until the battery is fully charged. The charging speed will slow down and you can save time by charging your car only up to 80% state of charge. You can think of the battery as a large parking lot. The size of the parking lot reflects the capacity of the battery. The emptier it is, the easier and quicker a car or electron can find a place. At an ideal battery temperature, more gates open. The parking lot or battery can be filled much faster. If the parking lot is 80% full, all other cars or electrons have to search longer for a place filling speed is reduced accordingly. Now let's get back to Porsche. We have added an option to monitor the battery temperature so that you can get a feel for how the battery temperature is evolving. To set this up, select the tube on the right in your instrument cluster by pressing this button on the steering wheel and select information. In case you don't see information regarding the battery, you can configure this in the Porsche communication manager. Choose, Settings, Displays, Instrument Cluster, Customized View and select the desired information to be displayed. We recommend to set current charge state, battery temperature and electrical system voltage. The ideal battery temperature for charging your electric Porsche as quickly as possible depends on many factors such as the state of charge of your battery at the start of the charging process. As a rule of thumb, the battery is most likely to fast charge around 30 degrees Celsius. The charger determines to a large extent how quickly an electric vehicle can be charged. The power of the charging point should always be higher than the maximum charging capability of the vehicle to achieve optimum charging performance and you can save time by charging your car only up to 80% state of charge. 
For even more peace of mind, use the Porsche Charging Planner when driving long distances. All you need is active route guidance in the built-in navigation system. The planner will do most of the things we have just talked about automatically in the background. It will also precondition your vehicle's battery so that you have the best possible condition for a quick charge. Have a look at our spot on video for the Porsche Charging Planner for more details or see you in the next video.